everyone and welcome to Free Games Part 361. The hell was that? Anyway, <clears throat> today I have prepared for you 12 games. What an asshole. I hope Ewoks will steal your speeder bike. Void Memory is a battle-focused side-scrolling 2D action platformer. It has uh, mixed reviews, but don't pay attention to them, because those are people whining about uh, difficulty. Get good! I played it for a short time and uh, literally didn't see nothing wrong with it. Space to jump, but... A zombo. Ha ha! Feel my wrath! Yes. That doesn't do much damage. The sword is uh, well better. <laughs> I fucked up! Death came for me! Dubium is an online survival and deception game set in a sci-fi environment where you play in a group of five, but one of you is a traitor and is tasked with escaping alone, leaving the rest behind. It does look uh, very nice and has an active uh, player base at the moment. Terminate is a top-down shooter which puts you in the role of an imperial captain. Your mission is to reclaim a galaxy shattered by centuries of infighting. The Destroyer is a single-player tower defense game where you will face alien monsters and ships in ground and space battles. Goblet of Mercy, a short interactive dark fantasy story in which you meet an egomaniacal empress and must try to survive the encounter through the choices you make. Alone in Space is a short 2D sci-fi RPG adventure with an interactive game environment, interesting plot, a score system, and two endings. George Mac. Gihan, Gamer Hero, is a simple yet challenging platformer where you jump on platforms avoiding annoying enemies and try to save a cat. She Fell Off is a third-person 3D precision platformer with a character that did too much squats.
Relaxing Lawn Mower Simulator is exactly what the title says and it seems it is made by a dev in a training what is very cool and hopefully we will get an update that adds a driver or maybe a totally remade game where you can loan, loan more uh, over Ewoks. Yes, that would be nice. Desktop Mark is a simple minigame-centric idler revolving around the silly character of Mark, a smiley that bounces, uh, bounces all around your screen. And when it hits the corner of your screen, a minigame pops up. I don't know about you, but uh, I would get very angry with, uh, with that very quickly. House of Jigsaw. Happy puzzling, happy home. Well, uh, it's a Jigsaw puzzle game. Explaining Every String is a simplistic bullet hell arena shooter with 15 levels and 6 boss fights. Ashes of Arcanum is an online tabletop RPG and if you are an experienced player, you will probably know how to um, play this with your friends. For me, this looks like black magic. I don't understand nothing. we are done for this episode hope you found something interesting for you to play thank you very 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 much for watching and i will see you next time uh, later today on the imperial news regarding the epic games giveaway bye bye